I don't think that you should now, knowing what I know and, and through some of the, the stuff that I've been through in my life, you know, I would never have got to where I am now without that counselling and without, without that assistance. And you know, it's not, not a bad thing for boys to cry. I'm quite open about the fact that, you know, I cry from time to time. It's not, not a regular sort of thing. You know, last Thursday, um, if I hadn't have gone, and last Thursday was the, the council meeting that dealt with the code of conduct, re the mayor. Um, I got myself out straight after the, the, the meeting was finished and I went down to Oriental Bay. I didn't cry, but I was really, really upset. You know, I'd internalised a whole lot of stuff. I wanted to say more, wanted to stand up more, felt that I couldn't because it would inflame things. Um, you know, and so I, I went, went down to to take in the beauty of the city and the beauty of, of, of our people too. You know, people know what's going on in the city. They know that, you know, we're, we're from a, a governance perspective, we're not handling things as well as what we should, and, and, and particularly um, collegially. Um, and it, it disturbs them as well. Personally, when you get to the stage that we've got to at council, you know, last Thursday was a, a really good example. Um, yeah, we, we probably need an organisational psychologist to help us all. You know, it, I'm a great believer now in, in that you know, we, we could be enabled. You know, we've tried to facilitate a bit, but you know, some sort of, um, it's not a bad thing to think that, that um, you know, a psychologist could help us. I think a psychologist could help at least most of us, um, if not all of us in some sort of way. You know, you just got to take it on board as being a positive thing.